as the setting of the love story Romeo and Juliet. Whilst also being rich in history, Verona is a unique place to visit in Italy. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we share the things to know before you go to Verona. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So firstly, let's look at the best time to visit. The most popular time to visit Verona is between July and August. This is the hottest time of the year and a great time to visit Italy. December is a cooler time to visit and also the driest time of the year. So this could be a great time to visit if you want to save money and don't mind the chilly weather. May, June, September and October see pleasant weather and are the best months to visit if you want decent weather, less crowds and fair prices. So now let's look at getting there. Verona is easily reachable by many of the cities in Italy. Trains are available for Milan, Venice and Bologna, whilst the highways make it easy to drive or take a coach to the city. If you are flying into Verona, you can find some direct flights from European cities, but stopovers in cities like Rome are common. So now let's look at getting around. Verona is an easy city to navigate. Firstly, you can walk around the city with ease as many landmarks are close to one another in the city centre. From the airport to the city, you can catch the airline bus or take an airport shuttle. You can also catch a bus to get around Verona itself with the Ticket Bus Verona app, making ticket purchasing quick and easy. You could also choose to rent a bike or e-bike to get around the city as well. Head over to the bikeverona.it to see the daily fees and sign up to the bike sharing program. We will leave the link in the description below. So now let's look at typical prices. Verona is a great place for those visiting Italy but looking to not overspend in the bigger cities. Hostel dorm beds can be found for around 35 euros a night, whilst budget private rooms can be found for around 60. Mid-range hotel rooms start at 90 euros and more luxurious hotels begin at 150. A small breakfast begins at 3 euros, whilst a quick lunch starts at 6. A sit-down dinner varies in cost depending on the location, but a free course meal can be found for around 30 euros per person if you are eating further away from the attractions. Verona can be visited on a budget if you know how to save. Firstly, head to the free attractions like the many beautiful squares. Get yourself a Verona card on Get Your Guide to save money on paid attractions including the Verona Arena and many museums and monuments. We will leave the link in the description below but this card also includes the public transport inside Verona City. If you want to see all of the churches there is also a Four Churches card available for more savings. Many museums in the city offer free entrance on the first Sunday of each month and the Verona Opera Festival, which runs from June to August, offers unreserved, inexpensive seats at the top level in the Roman arena. Enjoy food from the local delis and take advantage of the many parks for those sunset picnics. So now let's look at the best things to do in Verona. Verona is more than just a famous balcony. Firstly, head to the Verona Arena, a preserved national landmark located in the middle of the historic town centre. After taking a tour of the arena, make sure to explore the historic town centre too. Here you will find many churches, wide piazzas and Juliet's house. Then head to Castel Vecchio, an impressive castle that was originally constructed in 1354 and served as a mode of defence for the city. Head inside the castle to explore the museum and learn more about its history. Visit the Basilica of San Zeno, an important religious building in the city, which not only has stunning architecture, but is also depicted in the Romeo and Juliet play as their place of marriage. Visit the tallest tower in Verona, Tower Lamberti, then head into the Verona Cathedral. Spend time visiting St. Peter's Castle, then explore the Scaliger tombs. 
Watch this video to find out 10 reasons to visit Italy. Then to learn about the best places to explore in Italy, watch this video. We hope you have an incredible time in Verona and stay creative.